hello there. I'm just about to head out for a bit of sketching. I thought I would take you with me. Um, I'm just heading out from my mum and dad's place and I'm going to head down towards uh, maybe the seafront. I'm not sure. I'll see how far I get. There's um, some blackberries I want to pick on the way, so we'll see. We'll see if I get tempted by blackberries too much. Um, anyway, I'll head out my bike and I'll um, show you a bit of the scenery. So this is St Faith's Church in Havant. I decided to have a quick sketch of this and not go to the seafront as I only had a short period of time before I wanted to get blackberries and head back for lunch. Okay, so I've got my sketchbook. It's um, caddy and papers, or caddy papers, I assume. I think that's back to front, isn't it? When I'm feeling the film on the camera. Um, I've got my chewing gum, empty chewing gum pot of uh, water. My little watercolour kit, some paintbrushes, small one, number four, and a number twelve, water, and a pencil. So I'm going to have a quick go at sketching church first. This is going to be very difficult to see. I'm going to see if I can move you to a angle that you can see better. Hang on. Well, good news is I've bought a microphone. Bad news is it hasn't arrived yet. So here I am just um, doing some very quick sketching. <laughs> I mean, it's quick sketching anyway, but this is sped up 10 times. Um, this is using just a mechanical HB pencil. Um, I tend to use that um, just because I don't need a pencil sharpener and I never seem to have a pencil sharpener on me. And then um, sometimes I'll use my Cohen or Clutch pencil which has a 6B lead so it gets a sort of a darker, softer um, look to it but I can never find my pencil sharpener and it pretty much always remains um, dull so it's a bit of a frustrating pencil that one but I do like it. Um, you can see here I've just applied the watercolour. Um, the sky is a mixture of different blues, um, just daubed on in a pretty random fashion. Um, it was a little bit cloudy that day, so where the clouds are I've sort of done it a bit lighter. And I didn't have much time for this sketch, it really is just a very loose sketch um, whilst I'm out and about, so the whole thing probably took me about 15 minutes and the objective was just to apply as much um, paint as I could, as quickly as I could. Um, I don't mind if some of the paint runs into the, any of the other colours. If you don't want it to run, then make sure that you leave a, a little gap so that it doesn't run into the next colour. Um, so I'm just waiting for that to dry now. Um, you can tell whether things are dry or not by just changing the angle of the notebook. Um, and you can see if there's a little sheen on or not. Now I'm just applying some um, shadow areas. Um, they sort of just a purpley hue. I had to make up really where I thought that the lights and shades were on that church because it was all much of a muchness. Um, so I decided that I'd have the, the light coming in from um, in front. So that's why I've got some of the shady areas on the right hand side of that turret good trick to bring the foreground forward is to make them a lot darker than you're on what's further away so that's why I've got some of the gravestones quite dark and the threes quite dark to give it that 3d effect um, because I don't have much time I'm going over with a, my Cohen or clutch pencil just to add a few little finite details um, so I can go back and have my lunch uh, great so I think that's done for the morning um, this probably took me about 20 minutes or so all in um, I'm going to head back to my parents' place and uh, pick some blackberries on the way. just want to say, look at these blackberries. Aren't they huge? So I'm going to pick some blackberries before I head home. 